with the sling label facing outwards, slide the sling fully down the back of the patient. Take one leg section, place down the side and glide it fully under the thigh. Ensure that it is not twisted. Repeat the other side and ensure that the sling is not twisted. Thread one leg tape through the other tape on the opposite leg section. This will help prevent the legs from abducting. Attach all the tapes to the hoist using the appropriate coloured loops for the required positioning. If hip tapes are supplied, ensure that they are securely attached. Adjust using the stainless steel slider to the required position. Attach the webbing loop to the hoist. The hip tape should pick up the pelvic area and the legs simultaneously. If the sling is supplied with head support tapes, feed them through the shoulder tapes and back through the slider. Adjust to the required position using the slider. Attach the shoulder tape securely to the hoist. If waist or chest support is fitted, ensure that this is secured around the patient prior to the start of the transfer. Fasten the clunk click buckle and adjust firmly using the webbing strap. Attach all the remaining tapes to the hoist. Use the appropriate coloured loops for the required positioning. Ensure tapes are not twisted and are securely attached before transfer. For more information, please visit our website www.silverly.com.